Okay, um, I got a, you know what, my, my little nephew came down, and he brought a good, a good question, uh, uh, I never thought about that, and he said to me, how it work? He didn't say, what's that for? He said, he said, How's that work? And you know, it, 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 man, a lot of people up there, pretty sure they, you know, they, they was, they probably would have asked me the same question too. How this thing work? Okay, so I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna tell you how it work and how to break it down in detail, so you have a little very understanding how this thing work. You know, he brought a good point up, my nephew. I said, you know what, that's, that's a good point up because a lot of people, they don't, they see me talking over here about this, about that. But well, okay, so what's that for? You know, okay. Let's bring it on then. You know, you got your thermostat in your house, right? Your thermostat, is wired at some point from you, from the, your living room to the basement. There's a relay, it's a switch, it's a box. The, your thermostat wires to there, okay? Then from that box to here, it's wired. This motor is wired to that box, okay? From that relay, to your thermostat is 24 low voltage. It's 24 volt. Okay. And from that relay to here is 110. You get 110 going from the outside to the relay, and that relay is gonna bring 110 over here. So the way it works is when you raise your thermostat and you leave it room bathroom. Whatever you got your thermostat, okay, I want the thermostat, put, I want the temperature to be 80. What happened? That thermostat is gonna close because that thermostat, what it is, it's a switch. It's an open and close. That's what it is. It's a switch. So that thermostat is gonna close. Then it's gonna close the circuit in that relay. It's gonna tell that relay to send 120 volt to this pump over here. And what's gonna happen? This pump is gonna start working. And when that happens, and your boiler, if you got a boiler, you, let me see, you, it's supposed to be an arrow here someplace. It will tell you which way. See over here, if you guys can see it. You're gonna see the arrow over here, see the arrow? So that means the water going from this way to this way. So what's gonna happen, it's gonna, it's gonna take the hot water from the boiler, this pump is gonna push it upstairs to your room, to your baseboard, or radiator, whatever you got upstairs. It's gonna push it, and it's a big loop. It's gonna come around, come back around, and go back to the boiler. It's gonna push the hot water to your living space, and then it's gonna bring back the cold water back to the boiler. And that's how, how it work. You know, that's, that, that's how you, your house get heat up. Okay. Uh, well, how, okay, if it's a switch, I don't know. If, how, uh, how, how it's gonna bring the temperature to 80? Because what's gonna happen, this pump is gonna this pump is gonna keep running. Running, running, running. Keep running and the water, the water in the boiler is 180 degrees, so it's hot, a lot of hot water. And when that water get upstairs, they just keep out heat. Keep doing that. And when the thermostat satisfies, it's gonna open the switch again. When the when your room temperatures get around 80, the switch is gonna open and that's how your thermostat work open and close, open and close. But 
And then meanwhile, the pump keep running to the thermostat satisfied. So, and you see the arrow here, that's the way the water goes.